As a pagan priest, I have heard many confessions. I've been told by beautiful women how they handle their men. I've also had to school women on not losing their husbands through inappropriate conduct and a failure to produce love in them every day. When I guided a woman who was in my program for spirituality to try to read to her husband in bed, she alluded that it really started to work, that he became more tender and less of a jerk. And the aspect of having pillow talk and talking about the future of children was sort of working until an old matronly bitch on wheels from a gem shop started interfering in our relationship. You see, people always like to interfere in other people's plans, but people in general like to interfere in God's plans for people. And when people interfere with God's plans for people, the world of COVID is launched. Even a president of America can lie about helping people and yet totally destroy the same person that he alleges publicly that he helps. You see, there's always a monster in every government, but the monster might not be you. The monster is not the trouble. The monster is the liar who lies to people about their life, lies to people about their feelings, and lies to people as if they had a right to lie, steal, and cheat them out of love. 